I have ALS. Blanca, the tests confirm that you have HIV. I think it's important in the deaf community to advocate for and be a representative for this story, a story that uh, might inspire directors and other screenwriters to include uh, more deaf talent and uh, be more creative in the way you use deaf talent. I think that could be a wonderful thing to see, not only deaf actors but other disabled actors as well. Abilities Championships, a key feature of the Australian Open. And for all the All Abilities guys, a great thrill to be playing with all the best professionals in the world. Yeah, amazing. What, a, what an experience. It's also a really, really good thrill for them to see what we're capable of doing, understanding how hard, uh, difficult the game of golf is, and to see Juan hit it off one leg, Shane Luke. Jeff Nicholas is a legend of the sport, so a bit of a treat for them too, I'd, I'd like to say. Rise! Rise up! And let's get to work. We're tired of protesting. We're tired of going to these community forums that are not really solution-based. I'm going to be resilient, and I'm asking you all to be bold, courageous, and resilient with me. Together, we must remove the physical barriers we have created and the social barriers that we've accepted. For ours will never be a truly prosperous nation until all within it prosper. There, there are visible disabilities that you, you can see when there's a wheelchair user like Chill on the stage here right now, and then there are hidden disabilities. And so uh, corporations wrestle with this issue as well in terms of how many people they have with disabilities actually working in their organization. And for many individuals that have hidden disabilities, they don't really feel comfortable stepping forward unless they recognize that the organization's culture is really open to accepting people with disabilities. Mm -hmm. 